everyone! Welcome to our channel, Scratch Programming Projects for Kids. Today, I'm going to make a project which is creating your own virtual xylophone. You can play with the xylophone using your hands. So let's get started. First, I'm going to delete the Toby Sprite. And we don't need to select any sprites, we're going to make some. So I'm going to go and I'm going to paint. And first I'm going to do, for the xylophone keys, I'm going to make the red one. So I'm going to choose the rectangle and I'm going to make it fill. I'm going to make it fill red. Right here. And this is one red block for our first xylophone key. Now I'm going to write C here. I'm going to type in C. If this happens, it's I uh, just change it into black. We can drag anywhere. So this is our first key. Similarly, we can do it for the other keys. So here you can see I've made the other iPhone keys in rainbow order. And this stick is used for playing the xylophone, so I've made that too. Now, let's dive into coding. First, I'll get the extension, human body extension. So, right here. And we're going to wait for a while until this gets loaded. Now, we'll get our friendly one flat clipped head block. And I'm going to set the core. Uh, I'm going to set the position which is in it. So I'll first move. My, I'll first set this right here. And you can see here that in each of these blocks, and to go to X, Y, and to set X to, and what I said Y to, it's already copied. So, I'll just take this, which means that it's already been here. Now, I'm going to go and go to the human body, and I'm going to go and get Turn on video on stage with zero transparency so we can turn on the video and we can play with it. I'm going to get the forever loop and I'm going to get analyze image from hand for hand from camera inside the forever loop. I'm also going to put a condition. I'm going to put a condition which will check if the hand is detected. So, if hand detected, if it's hand detected, then we'll get, we'll go to motion, and I'll get the go to X and Y. I'm going to go and go to the human body. I'll get this little block right here and it'll be just x position of top of index finger so on the top of the in index finger the forever the stick will be always on my index finger same with the y it's going to be the same thing except this is going to be the y position and basically the same thing index finger now, I want to broadcast a message which 
when the stick will touch the one of the xiphones one of the xiphone keys it'll make a sound so i'm going to broadcast a message from the event and i'm going to put it inside the forever loop i mean inside the condition and i'm going to broadcast a new message sound And now, first I'm going to go to the red key for Do. And I'm going to get when I receive sound, when I receive sound, I'll get an if condition to tell that if the, if the stick touches the red key, it will just, uh, I'll go to sensing and if touching stick right here, the stick, then it should make a sound. We're going to go to sounds tab and we're going to pick a sound. I'm first going to get the C. the C and piano which is Do. I'll pick that Do. And now I'm going to go to the sounds, ta uh, sounds palette and I'm going to get play sound C electric piano until done. Now I want this to happen to every um every xiphone key but with a different sound so i'm going to drag this whole script i'm going to convert this into orange then orange will have the same script everything should be the same except the sound the sound will go back and i'm going to go to sounds tab and choose the sound it will be a D piano. So D piano. Which is just ready. Now let's go to back to the code and play sound D piano until done. I'm going to also convert this into that. And it's already converted inside here. So I'm going to take out this. We're going to do the same thing again and again. Choosing the sound. This time we're going to pick the E piano. So right here. E <coughs> piano. Which is me. <coughs> So play, so if touching stick, then play sound E piano. Convert it to green. And take out this block right here. Go to sounds and pick, choose a sound and pick F piano. So just do FP. Now this is Fa. So play sound F piano until done. Convert it to light blue, to the light blue, and it will now I'm going to take this do the same thing go to sounds choose a sound and this time it'll be G so G piano 
Space G Piano. And this goes right here. Convert this into navy blue. And now pick. Now pick a piano. Right here. Place on a piano until done. Convert this into purple, which will be B. Now I'll drag this right here. Go to the sounds tab. Choose a sound, and this time it'll be B piano. B piano. Right here, and put this right inside the condition. Last one, the pink one. Right here. Go to pink, and the colors are converted, and take out the block, and go to sounds, choose a sound, and it'll be. C piano. The last one. So we're going to choose C2 electric piano, the highest one. Let's go to code and put in C2 electric piano, play sound. Now, our script, you might even check it, our scripts are all done. Now, let's run the code. You can make your own xylophone like this. Play with it and have fun. Bye!